Hello, my name is Thomas Knieling and I'm working for Fraunhofer Institute for Silicon Technology as a scientist and a research manager. I'm presenting our process technology capabilities for quantum computing. So how is EZIT organized? Um, EZIT uh, deploys uh, th three business units uh, named uh, power electronics where advanced power transistors and battery systems for special applications um, are being developed. Uh, moreover, within the department, mic micro manufacturing processes, process integration and pilot production is being performed. Moreover, module services uh, for MEMS and PCB pack packaging and also reliability testing is being done. MEMS applications where I'm belonging to are developing um, optical systems like MEMS micro mirrors, acoustical systems like loudspeakers or micro actuators and as well as agglomerated microsystems. So what is EZIT well known for? For many years now we have been developing our MEMS mirrors, uh, which can be, can be driven uh, in one dimension or two dimensions, uh, can be piezo electrostatic driven and can also be resonant or quasi-static. They are being encapsulated in our very fair level vacuum packaging technique uh, with optical windows of different shapes uh, for keeping um, the vacuum or defined atmosphere inside and for mitigation parasitic reflexes. Moreover, we are developing um, MEMS micro arrays for optical cross connects, for instance, which are also piezo driven loudspeakers or loudspeaker arrays. Um, with our glass flow technology, we can provide um, several classes of optical elements like mirrors, lenses, prisms, and many others with different coatings. We are doing MEMS on glass or quartz glass. A special example here is our mass flow sensor. Also, we are doing 3D powder MEMS with metals, magnetics, and others, um, for instance, for energy harvesting applications. So I will not go into uh, detail in, of our process landscape. Um, as already mentioned, we are processing eight inch substrates, which can, uh, which are consisting of silicon or glass or quartz. Of course, we are doing lithography and several um, coating techniques, um, piezoelectric materials like PCT, aluminum nitride or aluminum scandium nitride, and different uh, wet or uh, dry etching techniques, CMP, wafer bonding and wafer grinding and thin wafer processing. So what can it do for you? So we are pro can provide MEMS parts, MEMS hardware, process and for quantum computing like ion traps. And of course, we are looking for joining projects in the quantum computing field, industry partners or networking. So do not hesitate to contact me.